Welcome to The Lounge. I'm your host, CK. It's RPTV. Today we have with me Mutadi. Hey, Mutadi, how's it going? I'm fine. How are you? I'm great. So tell me more about yourself and the program that you are doing here at Regent Park Focus. Well, we use Regent Park Focus to rehearse for the Mutadi International Drumming Festival. Okay. Which is now in its 14th year. Okay. And we, we are thankful and grateful to the opportunity given us to use this wonderful space. Mm. So you have with us a drum today? As I do all the time, every, yeah. every day. <laughs> you walk with your drum? All the time. Do you, like, like you're like Michael Jordan, you sleep with your drum? Do you? Well, not really, <laughs> but the drum is with me. Okay, so you're very connected to your drum. I think we all are. Yeah, yes. yeah. so everybody, there's a, there's a drummer in everybody, you would say? Once you have life, you're a drummer. Okay. Your drum is in your heart. And all our hearts beat to the same rhythm. I see. So we all have rhythm, the rhythm of life. So you were telling me before though about this, uh, there's like four types of drumming or four the, the, sounds? There the are four main songs that you get from hand drum. Okay. I'll demonstrate. That's a bass, a, a flat hand from just off center of the drum okay. for your bass. A tone, a slap, and muff or muffle. Interesting. So, how did you learn all these steps? Like, how did you come to know more about the drum? Well, I started drumming at a very young age, um, and I've I've learned as the years went by. I'm a student. I'm forever a student. A student of life, a student of the drum. Okay, the drum. So when did you get your first drum? The first time I touched a drum, I was age 16. Okay. I wouldn't tell you how long that was. <laughs> <laughs> but that was the first time I touched a drum. I, I played for a Catholic school concert and I was paid two dollars. Wow, that's big money. <laughs> that was in those days. <laughs> Today gets you a box of Timbits. So. <laughs> if, if you're so lucky. <laughs> so uh, when you see a student tick, touch a drum for the very first time, you know, and they're like, they're hitting it weird and wrong. Is there, is there really a wrong way to hit a drum? Yes, there is. And my challenge when I see that is correcting it and bringing people into the, the, the proper way of playing the drum, getting the correct sound out of the drum. That's why the first thing that I teach is how to get the sound out of the drum. Right. The, the sound that you're going for. That's the, the bass, the tone, the, the slap, and the muff or muffle. All right. Could you give me a demonstration of like a, a quick drum solo? A drum solo. <laughs> well, there's not much okay. more drums here, so it's going to be okay. one person. So the rhythm that I'm going to be playing is a Trinidadian rhythm, Trinidad and Tobago, called Jambalasi. Jambalasi takes a pattern of four bass and five toes. So it will sound like this. Awesome, that was amazing. Well, that's great. Um, I know a lot of people who are watching this would love to come and have you teach them. So more program information will be on our website. Uh, that's it for today on The Lounge. I'm your host, CK. Take it away.
Sub World, let's get it poppin' with TCU.